Guess not that much action happened. But that's the trouble when you're invisible. Can't find me, can you, Mr. Ryan? Nope. Oh well, I guess we should probably go looking for whoever's infiltrating. Even though the only door is going that way. Hmm. I think eventually they'll just wander into here if you give them long enough, but I guess we gotta go looking for them. Who's shooting at me? Oh, the turret's shooting at me. Herpeter. Oh, the big daddy's shooting at me as well. Well, I can fix that problem. Or can I? No, I guess I can't. Why is the big daddy mad at me? I am confused. No! Oh god! Did not anticipate having to find a big daddy in here. This is not good. Not good. Not good. Well, we can take care of him. Not a big deal. We just gotta switch to our rocket launcher. Come on. Are you dead yet? I think he's dead. I think I actually did kill him. saying nope a lot. I should probably figure out a different word to say during this interlude. Of course, there's not really much to do in here. Just kind of hang out. Let the turrets do the work. Can I snipe him through the window? I got some anti-personnel rounds. Maybe I can snipe one of them. Hello. Mm. Shot him in the foot. Shot him in the penis. Oh god! Don't die. Animus. And now we're going to have problems because I'm running out of health. I'm a fucking success. So maybe I should just kind of hide in the corner and start doing this the way I wanted to do it in the first place, which is super stinky stealth mode. Uh, it's just a bad quarter. Where are you? Yeah, Mark will come back, huh? Yeah, everything will be fine. Yeah, it'll all be fine. You call that tenderloin? If you serve that in any respectable hotel in New York, they'd laugh you out of town. <laughs> oh, don't worry, darling, they'll be back. We get a lot of splicer dialogue doing this. Um. Hmm. Should probably be getting a surprise ready for them. All I have is proximity mines. That's sad. And invisible again. Yay. Oh wow, I've got a lot of anti-personnel auto Nurse, rounds. I totally forgot about that. This nope. The biggest deal was the big daddy. Come on. Sometimes I forget which pills are which. I go by color. <laughs> Yeah, it's a little ridiculous. Come on. She didn't fit in anyway. I don't care where she's gone. <laughs> I'm like a rogue. You too. You too. I see you. 
Are you gonna come up here? Add to the body pile. I know you wanna come up here. Come on. Come on. Your programming says that you need to be near me even if you can't see me. <laughs> you think they would catch on. You think they would catch on. Let's go ahead and reload. Wait for more of them. Come on. I know that can't be all of them. Go ahead and collect our ammo. What was that? Is the vector ready? What are you waiting for? Hit the damn switch. Oh man, I'm hoping one of these isn't gonna be at Rosie's. Please don't explode. Uh I'm gonna go ahead and save guys. I don't wanna explode. I'm sorry, I don't wanna explode. I don't want explosions to happen because I don't wanna have to redo all of this. Whoa! Whoa! Oh shit! That's not good. Um, we can go ahead and do this, but I need first aid. I need first aid badly. Oh boy. Did not go as smooth as last time, I can say that by a long shot. I thought I was doing good for a second there, but near the end I started to get really sloppy and lazy. Alright, so let's ninja around and find us a first aid station. There's got to be one in here somewhere. Hang on, let me check the map. Um, yeah, there's one just around the corner. Okay, 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 I feel better now. Have I hacked this one yet? Oh, I don't want to hack it. I don't even want to chance it. They have Eve hypos, but I have to hack it to get them. Um, I think this is the really hard vending machine to hack too, so it's not really worth it to my time. Let's just get out of here. Let's get out of here. Arcadia's lame. <laughs> I hate this place. It's just, it's just lame. All right. Everything's quiet. Yep, we're good to go. Why are you so resistant to the traditional methods of separating a man from his soul? You're not CIA, are you? You belong to Atlas, the one roach I can't seem to exterminate. Don't worry, I just need time to find the proper poison. Okay, at this point you get a choice. You can go to Fort Frolic, which is the next place, and it's the the transit to get to the other four places or you can go back to the medical pavilion we are going back to the medical pavilion for a very good reason it's just a very minor bit of backtracking but it's very very important bit of backtracking this game is pretty much linear for the most part you go from place to place to place to place and there's no real reason to go back unless you forget something I didn't forget anything. What I need to get is something that I could not have gotten before because I didn't have the kind of weapon for it. Unfortunately, this place is now infested with some more splicers. Of course, they're all level 1 splicers, so whack, whack, and dead. So here's what we need to do. We need to progress through the medical pavilion, and I think I can pick up... Really cheap Eve hypos here. Yeah, I can. Cool. That's good. And we need to take pictures of that first Big Daddy we ever killed because he has respawn now. And the item you get from taking pictures of bouncers is absolutely critical to the strategy I use to play this game. So let's get this guy and let's get some pretty good shots of him. I could engage him in combat and get a better score, but I really don't want to. We already have Photographer's Eye. 
so that's stacking on top of that. And that's a full level and a half just from that one bouncer. I think I might be able to take one more picture of him, but I want to check just to make sure. I don't... I'm not sure. I don't know. Oh, I forgot to get this one earlier when I came through here. <laughs> I'm sorry. So, <laughs> totally forgot about that audio diary for some reason. The ones on the walls are really hard for me to pick out for some reason because I'm just not expecting them to be there. But the ones that are just kind of like behind boxes and in boxes and whatever are perfectly fine. Don't really understand that. But we, we have everything we came back to the medical pavilion for, so now we're going to venture onto Fort Frolic. And I'm not sure if we're going to do this right now. Or we're gonna get into the first part of it and then pick up on it later but I kind of want to introduce you to my favorite character in the game yes he is my favorite character in the game and he is my favorite character for several reasons first of all he's crazy he is insane he is completely batshit That's better. Atlas Ryan. Atlas Ryan. Da 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 da. Time was, you could get something decent on the radio. The artist has a duty to seduce the ear and delight the spirit. So say goodbye to those two blowhards and hello to an evening with Sander Cohen. Welcome to Plot Derailment. Sander Cohen is not going to allow us to proceed for a very small amount of time. He wants to play with us first. And this part of the game is kind of, seen a sign of tacked on. Down here in months. That doesn't Let's mean it's see. bad. If you're just another Johnny come lately, maybe something more. Cohen commands an army of spider splicers, and this part of the game is actually incredibly entertaining. He is a cool, cool guy. Especially if you've done all the research on spider splicers, because all these dudes give you a health kit. I don't know why you're up there. Get down. Where'd you go? Get down. Smell the malt of vinegar in this one. I've waited so long for something tasty to come to this little burg, but all that pass are yokels and rubes. Where are my manners? Come in! Come in! Sander Cohen awaits you at the Fleet Hall.
And now Fort Frolic is open. We are going to get in here and we're going to have a wonderful time of it with Sander Cohen. And afterwards, we're going to head on to Hephaestus and get Ryan where he deserves it. At which point, we should be good to go. This has been an evening with x Law. Hope you have enjoyed yourself. And I look forward to seeing you in the future.